Welcome to episode 2 from Fremont City. This is a mini-series where I explore the campus DLC. Um, I had a lot of fun building the university last episode, um, and I'm going to continue on that progress here. Um, starting off here, I just wanted to give an overview. So one of the things that inspired me to work in this city particularly is... This is my baby. I love this city. Um, so just giving an overview of it right now. Um, one thing I would like, uh, any suggestions, help, helpful comments uh, down below is, I'm working on a LUT. I, I like this. So um, one thing that I would like to do, it's going to come up here and I'm, it's almost done. I feel so great that I did, I finally did cinematics. Oh, that's such a, that's the money shot right there. That actually deserves a screenshot and right there okay okay get rid of this thing and let's go over here and get you back over here uh, go to cinematics okay so I'm gonna leave it right here for one second so um, like I was saying I would love any kind of helpful feedback on LUT so where this is based out of in is very very loosely so the the topography I imported from um, a, a, a bit, I can't remember terrain party I think it is um, you you guys know if you play this game at all you know exactly what I'm talking about um, anyway so this is from Port Angeles Washington is where I got this map and so I kind of wanted to stick with that northwestern northwestern kind of feel a little bit of Vancouver Seattle Portland all mixed into one so I kind of want to go over that really quick before we dive down into the campus DLC because again part of the reason I'm doing this is to give you an overview of the city so let's start off with that so um, first off I want to inform you that this does not exist in Port Angeles. What does exist is this. Um, I should have been better prepared. Is it? Yes, it's going to do that crazy thing. So, next episode, I will actually have an image of Port Angeles and you can see kind of what's going on here. But what I will say is in Port Angeles is there's this giant hook. It's, I'm pretty sure it's Edis. E D I Z hook. Um, that kind of wraps around out here. There's no tall buildings in Port Angeles at all. Um, if you're from the Northwest, you'll understand what I'm talking about. But there is these two little rivers um, that kind of feed down into Port Angeles Harbor right here. Um, you also have one right here. And this one doesn't exist actually in Port Angeles, but I do believe this one does. This is getting over towards like Squim and stuff like that. Um, let me get back over here. Yeah, so there's this giant hook that wraps out and around. Um, and I played with that on one of my series. So I've used this Port Angeles um, template quite a bit in a lot of different builds. Um, one of them had the hook. This one I didn't want the hook. And I think this actually turned out really well. So very much Seattle, Port Angeles, Vancouver um, inspired. Um, yeah, so kind of real quick on what those cinematics covered in the beginning. So as I was getting closer to the end and kind of just getting drained of creativity, um, I needed... A huge industry area one because I had a ton of trash over here um, so I kind of just threw this down a lot of this is intermixed with the industries DLC that I was playing around with and explore exploring that this just ignore that because I do plan on doing something with that that actually will look really good right now it's just there um, let's see kind of working our way back over here um, Let's see. So, um, 
The Park Life DLC came out when I started working on, uh, kind of finished right here when Park Life came out. And so this is where my amusement park is. Um, and my zoo. So I really enjoy both of those. I enjoy Park Life a lot. Wow, there is some funky, funky things going What is going on with that? That's like the road painted onto the bridge. Okay, well, that's just awkward. Anyway, huge business park over here, um, and yeah, let's get let's get building, let's get cracking. Um, I will explore kind of what would be behind us. Um, you can kind of see the taller buildings of downtown right here. We'll get into downtown um, in the next episode, but I want to build a couple things in the in the campus here. So let's go ahead and get into my build here. So last episode, I laid down our foundations. I talked about how. Um, I, I attend Utah Valley University, which is completely inside. You don't have to go out outside at all, except to get in the car or get on the bus. Um, so kind of a new adventure here building outside. But from what I do know about general U university campuses, such as the University of Utah or Brigham Young, the other two, um, campuses near me, is that, um... A lot of the general education buildings are more in the center of campus, kind of off of your main, whatever we want to call this, garden, plaza, clock tower. It's kind of more based off of that. So, I think I built a library, um, this is the study hall, media lab, the bookstore, you have the laboratories over there. I think this is the cafeteria, yep, and auditorium, math lab, and I believe that's the chess club. Okay, so, and then we finished up building the bus routes and kind of reworking it um, to fit in here. So this time, I'm going to focus on this big green space. It looks like we just had a, a football game. Um, we won, which is good. There's a dead person there. So exciting. Um, so that looks like that just got out, and because of that, what is that? Oh, that is a post truck. That is interesting. Because of that, <coughs> excuse me, um, tons of people. Also, it looks like we have a current match going on at the Aquatic Center. So tons of people enjoying my my new university or university sports here. Um, Okay, let's get into the, let's go, we're building a university campus, and this time we are going to put down the faculty building. So, um, my first thought was, because, let's see, this guy is so massive, I want this building, let's go ahead and get rid of this gas station, I want this big tall building be on like the corner so I think we're gonna put that one there which I think is perfectly fine that is a very big building but I like it okay um, I think the best thing instead of doing pass I think we do this I'm uh, actually really liking where this is going here the, this is, what is this? The School of Law facing the sports stadium, and holy smoke, that is a very giant building. What is that? That is the science building, I believe, the School of Science. So, I like that. That actually looked out worked out really good. I like how these building types are similar. Looks like maybe these buildings got built first, and then the law school got built second. I like that. I like having a little bit of a story background to what we're doing here. Okay, let's go ahead and get a path. I'm going to go with this one. I'm going to drag it across. Um, I'd love to get a path down through here, maybe. Don't know why we're elevating that, but I think we're going to go ahead and do that. We'll get this brought down a little bit here. 
And I'm not quite sure why it's doing that, but we'll get it fixed there. There we go. There we go. Okay, down here, let's see what kind of parks we have. We have an academic statue. statue we have the chess club we have the media auditorium academic statue one what is this one um so again the first one I, I talked about this i've never played this before this is the first time i've placed down any of these buildings so forgive me i'm kind of just looking at the same time as we're we are actually putting down stuff. So math club, I do not believe that is in this other campus, is it not? Yes, the math club is right there. The only thing I do not have is the commencement office. I was kind of hoping to get that down in here. Uh, no, I'm not going to put it there. I could potentially put it here. I don't like that either. Where am I going to put commencement? <clears throat> I could put it over here, but that just doesn't make any sense. I'll have to figure that one out. Where do I put commencement? I don't really leave a whole lot of room for commencement. I do want commencement. I mean, I guess I could put it... What does it look like right here? Maybe clipped it into that building. I have a ton of little trees right through here. Let's get rid of that real fast. I thought I was on fairly level ground here, but it doesn't seem to be so. Simple fix with the move it mod. Just bring that down here. Quite honest, I kind of like it right there. Let's see if we can unclip some of those trees. Or does that feel a little too squeezed in there? Hmm. I like this being here. I'm just trying to look around here. Maybe we can move some stuff around. I mean, I technically don't need that building right off of... Uh, what are we going to do here? Um, nope, not that one. I want this button. I'm going to go ahead and relocate you here. Do a little bit of changes. So let's go ahead and bring the auditorium. Let's see if we can actually squish this and actually you right there for now. I'm going to bring you up. <clears throat> Just leaving a little gap there. I'm going to need my path. Wasn't planning on doing this, but I would really like to squeeze in whatever we can here. Okay. building and does not now fit there without clipping into the subway station. Okay, I think I like that. This guy, I'm going to relocate it to right there. That works. Can I relocate the cafeteria? Let's see if we can pack this core a little bit more. I like that building there. Building works perfect there. I can't really get it to squeeze in any more than that. <clears throat> but what I can do is I can come and destroy this path and this path and this path. And not that one. 
not the destroy one. Relocate this one so it is center on that. <clears throat> Relocate this building right there. Rebring in the path how I had it. Um, that looks perfect right there. I'm still gonna have it come up here. <clears throat> like it was doing before, excuse me for that. And put you in there like that, and hopefully commencement can go in there just like that. Let's see, commencement. Oh, much better. I like that a whole lot more. I think I actually might put down... The auditorium, math club, library, gym, groundskeeping. I don't know what this futsal club is. I did learn, I was watching another person do this, and futsal is a, like an indoor soccer, it looks like, so I'm gonna put that there. <clears throat> and then, not that one, still getting used to the past being in here. I'll kind of bring it out like that. I like that. I really like that. Get rid of the commencement office over here because it did not fit in. And rejoin that path. Okay. I actually really like that a whole lot. And we're getting close to being done here. Um, let's see. Academic work. Discovery, I will give you $10,000 to do that. Varsity Sports, we are not going to, so this is one thing I wanted to do. We are going to be the Eagles. I have no sympathy for the Eagles, I just think it's a lot better. So we are going to do, not full out here. I have 10 coaches. The team color is going to be a very much a green. Let's make this look good. And this will be what we end on here. Let's go. I like that green. Okay. Basketball. Same thing. Football. Oh, that was baseball. Swimming. We've lost a lot of games here. Well, let's hire... I have 15 coaches. Policies, okay. Visiting scholars. Okay. Universal education, nope. And we're gonna do that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do advertising for this one. And and they'll get a free lunch for attending the University of Fremont. Okay, let's go ahead and play this for... Um, we're going to go for about another minute here as I finish off. Let's just see if I can get some trees in here, make this campus look real nice. One thing I actually might do here. Oh, I keep clicking on the wrong button. I'm going to put my own trees. Down. And I do like that tree that I just put down. I don't know if it matches these ones, and that's why I like it. Let's go... Let's get a couple more in here. I know, vanilla trees bug me too, everybody. I can't, I'm not gonna do anything much about it. I know there's mods and stuff like that, and 
can't be bugged down by him. Okay. Oh, jeez. I forgot about that building. Forgot about one building. Um. Oh. Ooh. Okay. What's, uh, gonna have to move? Put foot solve. Whatever that sports name is. And we're gonna put you right there. Does it interrupt with anything? Yeah, it puts parking lots down, but I can handle that. Okay. <clears throat> well, everybody, thank you so much for watching. I There was a thousand students attending that building right there. Um, we are going to put a parking garage. <clears throat> I got something in my throat. Um, okay, yeah. How many are in there? A thousand. Wow. And almost a thousand. How many? I got a lot of garbage piling up. Demic works. Sure. I'd love to see. Info. We're not even close to the end how much we're spending we are almost at full capacity though um, so that is something that we will continue to work on next uh, time we'll build our dorms and I think our main campus here is looking pretty good I think it's fits into the city quite nicely um, the next one we'll build is the liberal arts college and that is going to be out here on Bedford Park um, and we'll have a nice, a nice little, uh, liberal arts college out there. So until next time, thank you for joining me, um, in this, ex uh, exploring, um, the campus DLC from City Skylines. Until next time, Bean signing off.